but I'm telling you. No, but I'm just forcing that I like it. <laughs> Hi everyone, welcome back to our channel. So for today's video, rather for tonight's video, I'm not gonna do any book review, but I'm gonna be doing a reading vlog. I've been wanting to do this kind of vlog, but I'm still trying to find the right book and I think tonight I finally found the one. <laughs> So tonight, May 11, 2020, at the exact 9.30 in the evening, I'm going to start my first reading vlog. And the book that I chose for this reading vlog is The Silent Patient by Alex Michaelides. So let's read about the author and get to know him. Alex Michaelides read English at Cambridge University and screenwriting at the American Film Institute. He wrote the film A Devil You Know, starring Rosamund Pike and Coro de Con is On. His debut novel, The Silent Patient, is also being developed into a major motion picture and has been sold in 39 territories worldwide. Born in Cyprus to a Greek Cypriot father and English mother, Michaelides now lives in London, England. Well, I don't know much about this book. The only thing that I know is that there's this girl who killed her husband and she never speak again. This is a psychological thriller book and I'm really excited to devour it. And so yeah, let's get started. writing style is so interesting i think it's from uh the third person perspective but also i'm guessing that the writing style is actually from a first person who is one of the characters inside the book so it's so cute and so interesting and i want to find out more so i was right it's a first person narrative of one of the characters in the book and I like the Greek names so far in the book. And yeah, it's so interesting. She killed her husband and she never speak again for some reason. So I just finished reading the first three chapters. And I'm not going to stay up late tonight because I have work tomorrow morning. So probably I'm going to continue reading this tomorrow morning before... I start working but yeah I enjoyed reading the book I like the um, the writing style it, it was so funny and it was easy to read so I think that's gonna be it for my first reading vlog for tonight and then I'm gonna continue reading by tomorrow and I'll keep you updated Good morning everyone. So I woke up late actually. It's around 7.50 and I still have um, 40 minutes to read before I start working. So let's start reading.
far, I like this character, Theo Faber, a psychotherapist, and he really wants to cure Alicia Berenson, the one who killed her husband. And now he's going to the secure psychiatric unit. What I remember in this story um, is like when I was reading Asylum by Johan Thurin, and the protagonist there is, you know, going to the high security asylum. So it was kind of nice to remember. So I really need to start preparing now because I'm going to start working in a few minutes. But so far, I like the book very easy to read the chapters has few pages so you can browse through chapters it's like the stalker by Lars Kepler it has 139 chapters but the chapters are small so you can just browse it and read it as fast as you can and it's a good one also <laughs> finished uh, work from 8 30 till 4 30 and now i'm going to read for a few minutes because i need to rest my eyes and then yeah i'll keep you posted so yeah i'm just gonna take a small nap and just continue reading afterwards because i need to rest my eyes So for the brief update, I'm on part 2 and it's starting again from Alicia Berenson's diary which is so cute because it is how the part 1 also started. Yep. So yeah, I'm on page 63 of... Three hundred and thirty-nine. Two hundred and thirty-nine pages. So I just finished working from nine to five thirty. I'm working in the office today, and I'm just gonna rest my eyes for ten minutes, and then I'm gonna start reading. But I'm just forcing that I like it. <laughs> so let's do a simple test. If you're really paying attention to the stories that I was telling you. What? <laughs> let's do a reading test. So let's do a test. If my boyfriend is really paying attention to the stories that I was telling him about the books that I was uh, reading during the <laughs> Okay, so. If you remember the story of something in the water, what is it all about? It was, uh, there's something in the water. <laughs> what the heck? I don't remember. Something in the water, you know the story. No, it's, you told me many stories, I forget that. Yeah. Uh, but I was sure the that there's something in the water. Yeah, something in the water. Ah, what? Yeah, with the money, with the money. Eh? <laughs> nice, one point, one point, baby. Next, three points. I'm going three points. Lang, until three points. Next, the shape of water. The shape of water. It's the water of the shape. <laughs> Tell me, what's it all about? Uh, I know, we'll order. I don't know. Let's order. Okay. Bye. So someone bought KFC. Why? Why, Le? Why? <laughs> Where is that? I say you! <laughs> so, the next book, baby, The Shape of Water. 
tell them the story? Uh, it was like, oh my god, so Baby, nice. the shape of water. Oh, oh, the passing from my word. The shape of water, baby. Huh? You know this. Come on, the shape of water. It's the shape like your face. <laughs> <laughs> no, okay, okay. It's the one, the guy. With the guy, what guy? The fish man. Oh, oh god, you're so good. Okay, last question. It's gonna be a difficult one. Um, the child. Tell me something about the child. The child? Was a child and she grew up. <laughs> Are you sure that's your final answer? Was the child? The child. The child. Ah, the child was the one. Oh, the stormy. I love the child. The that they make her, him, her, uh, hypnotize. Oh my God! You're so right. You're so the right. The Kakala murderer and the. Uh, yes, yes. It was not the kid, it was... See, he was paying attention. Yeah, I was forced to... I'm telling you the stories. Because sure, later you, you will ask me and then later, <laughs> you didn't pay attention to me. And then we start fighting. The stalker, fighting. you know, the stalker. The stalker, the YouTuber and killing. Oh yeah, you're so good. So which one do you like the most? You. <laughs> From the four of the... Nothing. Do you like any? I like the... with the money. Ah, with the money, something with the water. Which is very interesting because they were like young couple, right? Yes. And then they, they had money under the water, <laughs> and the money didn't get they wet found under a bag the water, which was full of cash and diamonds. And it was not wet by the water. But right, someone betrayed someone, right? Yeah, yeah, betrayed. You know. Because if someone has a lot of money, they become yeah, so always, greedy. Uh, and always the guys fall. Why you know? <laughs> always the girls has to leave? In the horror movie, the girls leave always. And the, the guy dies. Always die. The guy is doing everything but he dies in the end. Exactly. The girl are doing everything and they're This vlog is, is, is getting too long. So yeah, say bye. 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 So we're going to eat with the kids. We're going to eat, guys. Hello. Hello. The car about can fly. So we eat KFC. Eat KFC. Yes. Yeah. And then someone got my book. This one. What book is this? <laughs> my God! <laughs> so fat! <laughs> the book thief. It's actually 9 40 p.m. and my boyfriend just left because he had his dinner with me tonight and I just started reading little update so you would know when you're reading a book from a greek author and the character just said bo, 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 bo. <laughs> and yeah the most of the names are greeks and there are phrases that are greek related so yeah so i just reached the page 100 and the psychotherapist theo just found out that his wife for nine years just cheated on him well that's how he got her by you know by cheating by their excess so i think it was bound to happen and once a cheater always a cheater so it's just sad because he's gonna be fucked up again and that's for the update and on a, i'm on page i'm currently on page 103 and it's only 339, right? 339. So, let me get a good read tonight to devour more pages. I don't know if this is a story of the silent patient or the story of the psychotherapist who's supposed to be treating her. It's all about the story of this psychotherapist, Veo. And it's so interesting because he himself is fucked up. And he's trying to save this girl, Alicia, who is obviously fucked up by killing her husband. So, okay. So this Veo becomes a psychotherapist. But in the past, he had his own um, psychotherapist as well because he was dealing with mental health issues. And his psychotherapist 
just told him that choosing a lover is a lot like choosing a therapist. We need to ask ourselves, is this someone who will be honest with me, listen to criticism, admit making mistakes, and not promise the impossible? Damn, that's so good. That's a good advice. Like, wow. You know, Theo, one of the hardest things to admit is that we weren't loved when we needed most. It's a terrible feeling, the pain of not being loved. Okay, all right, all right. All right. You don't have to hurt me. Good. update for my reading vlog so it's thursday night and i started reading from 8 40 and now it's 10 20 p.m and i finally reached page 200 and so far it's going good i mean it's still a mystery about alicia and she's not speaking still but she is now starting to paint i still have 139 pages to consume and i don't know if i'm gonna read that much tomorrow night because it's movie night with my boyfriend and he's going to um sleep over at my place so i don't know when i will finish this but i'm hoping soon and i'm gonna read also after work tomorrow because i'm not reading um, before work because I don't have time because I'm working at the office tomorrow so yeah I have my hot chocolate here and I'm still gonna start reading again Page 230 when the trail begins and there's this guy a man who's watching Alicia from afar and she's telling it on her journal and then she gave this journal to Theo and yeah on page 230 and I think I'm gonna stop now because it's already 11 and I need to sleep. I'm so sorry. Do the one now, There's no hope for my reading vlog. I'm not gonna read no tonight because we are it. <laughs> it's my brother's birthday, so yeah. Oh my God. There they are. Soon, but I still have to work. I have to kill myself. <laughs> Pag nag-re-reca yung parang playground sa court, push mo, Mag ang maganda. Oh, yeah. Yung 5 by 5 yun. Hi everyone, it's Saturday night and I took a bath and then I started reading from 9pm until 10pm. So I've been reading for an hour now. And I'm on page 318 and I must say that this book is mind-boggling this book has full of mind games and it makes me read more and more and more it's such a page turner i'm currently on page 318 where it has the biggest and unexpected twist and this book has only 313 pages so i can't wait to finish the book and to have a wrap up
presentation by Alex Michaelides and I have to say Alex Michaelides thank you for this beautiful book and I'm so happy that I finished it. The book is so good and it had the biggest twist and I didn't guess that it could possibly happen. So overall I decided I'm not going to spoil the ending because I don't want to waste this kind of beautiful book oh my god it's beyond imagination i love the structure of this book because it has the diaries from alicia and the um first person narrative from theo and it's just beautifully written so wow i'm gonna give this book of course five out of five this book is a mystery thriller and um, has lots of mind games and it was so shocking. I was dumbfounded when the twist happened. So, oh my god. And I guess that's it for my long reading vlog and I hope you like it and I'll see you in the next one.